welcome back to my channel. In today's video, you're gonna be hanging out with us. It is a Saturday morning. My husband has work, and it's just me and the kids, and I'm gonna show you what we do on a Saturday when I'm by myself. Um, we're gonna be doing some baking. I'm gonna show you a crock pot meal. I'm also gonna show you an easy, inexpensive DIY like Christmas craft, and maybe some other fun stuff along the way. So, stay tuned, I hope you enjoy. All right, so last week I showed y'all my pumpkin spice latte, and now I'm gonna show you my cinnamon dolce latte. We're gonna froth. Four. I like to give it a little spin. Do some out of that and cinnamon. All right, and there you have it. All right, so in last week's video, I showed like a little sneak peek of something that I've been working on and it's actually been some merchandise that I made for myself for my brand. So no judging the broken camera, but this is the merchandise that I have been working on. It's a sweatshirt that says, enjoy the simple life to go with my brand. And on Instagram, I asked y'all if you would be interested in getting it. And a lot of you said yes. So, well, depending on what it looked like. So this is what it looks like. I've also made baseball tees that go with it for the winter. And they come in five different colors, grays, blacks, whites, um, stuff like that so if you like it um i'm gonna be wearing them probably in most of my videos for y'all to see and the different colors but if you're interested stay tuned um after the new year in january i'm gonna be putting them up for y'all to buy for a limited time uh, uh, it's 9 45. sybil doesn't want to take a nap so we're gonna have a snack. Yeah, do you want a snack? So here's what we have. These are I1 Organics. These are organic protein puffs and sticks. And I will leave a link to them down below. These are so good and they come in some really neat flavors. Um, my husband likes the Tapatio. Um, my favorite is the sweet Dijon mustard, but these are so good. My kids love them. I will leave a link for them down below for a deal for you guys if you want to check them out. Thanks, I want organics for sending them to us. All right, guys, which flavor do you want? Do you want cheese? Do you want mustard? Do you want barbecue? What do y'all want? The red ones, bell pepper. These are one of my favorites too, I forgot. This is mustard. Mustard. You wanna try the mustard? These are the puffs, really good. Cheese. Cheese. So these are the sticks. Oh, <gasps> My kids really like these snacks, and I do too. I brought them to work for like a whole week. And they were one of those snacks where you just can't wait to eat them, you eat them as soon as you get to work. Check in my P.O. box. Nothing, nobody cares about me, I guess. I love Instacart. Got my groceries for the week. Okay, so the meal that we're gonna do today is a crock pot meal using some leftover turkey from Thanksgiving. It's got a little bit of cranberry sauce on it, but it's okay. I'm gonna chop this up with some vegetables and we're gonna make like a turkey wild rice vegetable soup. Sound good? No. No? Anyways, we're gonna eat this with saltines, cornbread, something like that tonight. And then we're gonna show you an easy dessert you can make at home with a handful of ingredients. You wanna show them that too? 
Yeah? Okay, she's not sure, but I'm gonna show you. Um, are you my little mini me? No. No, you just copy me all the time. <laughs> Okay, so now we're gonna let this cook on low for eight hours and then later we're gonna add in a little bit of half and half and some wild rice and it'll be ready to eat. The dessert that we're gonna make is monkey bread. Um, it's so good for breakfast. It's not healthy at all, but I really wanted to make something like this. So the only thing that I had to buy for this was biscuits, everything else, you usually have on hands um, butter cinnamon brown sugar sugar pecans or walnuts are optional so that's what we're gonna make really quick Fourth cup of brown sugar, a whole cup of sugar, cinnamon. All right, so now I'm gonna unroll all my biscuits and I'm gonna cut them into fourths and then mix this all in it, put it in my pan and then pour the butter over the top and then cook it at 350 for 35 minutes and it's delicious. Hey, do you don't like monkey bread, Camla? I'm gonna let this cool and then we'll take it apart and eat it. Good job, Seba. Good job, Seba. Seba. Seba, Seba. The little craft I'm making, I'm doing because I have a ton of mason jars and I'm going to kind of make them look like frosted glass jars for Christmas time. So all you need are some sort of glass jars or vases. We are going to line them with Mod Podge and then we are going to sprinkle them with Epsom salt and glitter and then we're gonna seal them with like a clear spray so that the glitter doesn't come off and then I'm gonna try to like decorate the rim with ribbon so and then you put a tea light inside of them let's do it I wake up on Sunday morning feel that inside my heart
Okay, so I just went outside and I sprayed the inside with this sealer, like a clear sealer, but this one has glitter in it. Um, I paid more for it. You don't have to. You could totally just use like clear spray paint. All right, so I had some like little yarn and I cut these apart and tied them on here. So now I'm gonna take this ribbon and put it around after to kind of hide it. is here. Half of my cake is here. But it tastes amazing. And that is it. We are gonna eat this soup with saltines, some cheese on top, and that's it for this cold, rainy winter day. I will see y'all again for my next video. This weekend, I'm gonna be doing a $5 dinner soup video. You're not gonna wanna miss. It's been like almost a year since I've done a $5 dinner video, so I'm planning on bringing it back. Let's do it. I will see y'all again. Y'all have a great week. Bye, everybody.